Hi, uh, Jonathan York from Bay Financial Partners, uh, looking at the investment markets. Um, certainly quite a bit of been been made in the uh, media recently about uh, Mighty River Power now falling uh, below the issue price of $2.50. Um, really what people have got to remember is that this is a longer term investment. Uh, if you bought it for a, uh, a short sort of profit, that really wasn't the, uh, the investment vehicle to be using. Um, you know, you are buying a quality asset um, and you're looking for sort of two, three, four years down the road. Um, you're still getting a reasonable dividend yield and uh, certainly there's no reason to be panicking here just because the, the uh, price has fallen slightly below the issue price, currently trading around $2.47. Knew that fall in uh, Mighty River Power has been accompanied by a little bit of nervousness in the equity markets as uh, they start to digest the news coming out of China that uh, growth is a little bit uh, slower than anticipated. But again, it's really got to be put into context. Uh, if you're looking at uh, GDP growth on an annualized rate of around 7.6 to 7.8, that compares with New Zealand around sort of 2 to 2.5, Australia 2.5-ish, um, the US as well about sort of 2.5, possibly 3. Um, so it does have to be put into perspective. I and mean, certainly at sort of 7.6 to 7.8, that is sustainable over the next sort of 5 to 6 years. Whereas if it was still growing at sort of uh, 9, 10, 11%, that's really unsustainable. The other story out there which has uh, spooked the markets a little bit has been uh, the talk about the possible slowing or tapering off of the, the US uh, stimulus going into the economy there. But again, that's, uh, you know, that should really be viewed as being positive because the only reason that the Fed will be looking at tapering that off is that if the economy is growing under its own steam and doesn't need quite as much assistance. So again, really that should be viewed as being positive. Um, but the market's taking it uh, on, the, on the negative side and certainly a little bit nervous. There's still uh, the Infratel bond uh, issue in the marketplace, uh, that's 6.85%. Until uh, fixed for until June uh, 2022, um, interest is paid quarterly, um, and as soon as uh, they receive the application form and the check, um, the interest rate is start to be earned at say 6.85. Um, so that is a reasonable rate given where interest rates are currently. And if you are looking for income, uh, that is uh, really about the only option out there in the fixed interest market at present. Um, so if you are interested in that, call us on 0800 867 323. And also if you're interested in the potential Z Energy uh, IPO and also Meridian, uh, which will be the next state asset, sold, uh, state asset sales, um, say call us on 0800-867-323. Or go to the website www.bayfinancialpartners.co.nz for lots of interesting articles, applications, and we look forward to speaking to you soon.